here we are with my partner in crime, Lucien, and we are drawing a character from a Julia Donaldson, Axel Scheffler book, The Room on the Broom. So we are going to get started. Now this is a rather fabulous uh, witch. Now that's that's your side and that's my side, okay? So don't come into my side. Right, we're gonna start off. We're gonna make sure we've got enough space. So we need to pay attention to size. And we're gonna start off with the witch's hat, okay? So we're just gonna do a little line here, like this, an angle. Okay. And then we're going to go up, across, and then back. And then she's got this slightly kind of wobbly Looks a little bit like a penguin with no wings at the moment, but it's not. Very nice. Okay. We're going to do like a sausage shape around the edge to create the rim of the hat. So bring it all the way up and like that. You can tell these sharpies are new. The ink is literally desperate to get out. Another sausage shape here, which is the top of her placid hair. Okay, so we're just going to come up like that to so about the middle. A couple little lines. That's it, press nice and lightly. And we'll do the rest for plastic in a minute. So next up is the eye, one eye. Now don't press too hard with the pen, because like I said, these pens are new and they are um, they are very inky. So pressing lightly, we're going to do one eye there. That's it. And then a dot. So what you find with Axel Scheffler characters is that their eyes are often um, looking to, in one direction, often to the side. Okay. Now we're going to do her nose before we do the other eye. Now the nose is going to start here and it's going to go down with a little wart, well, quite a big wart to be honest with you, and it goes down into a sort of sausage shape and then it comes up and around. It's a bit like your nose actually, Lucia. <laughs> Don't you worry, okay? Don't you worry about it. Now we're going to do the other eye here, it comes around like this, okay? And then again, looking in the same direction, that's it. Pressing lightly. Don't you worry, Lucien, it's okay. Come on, keep up. Dot on the left. That's it. And then we're going to come down here with the edge of her face. Try and press nice and lightly with that pen, because it's, that's it. That's it, look at that nose. <coughs> it's a thing of beauty. Try as a wobble the table, because the camera will shake, and then the uh, viewers will get all annoyed with me, so. Thank you. So, nose. Now, underneath the nose, we are going to come down with a little line like that. That's it. And then we're going to do the smile. Now, the smile. She's a smiling oh, witch. <laughs> well, we got to we got to roll with that one. So carry on. <laughs> got to carry on. Then what we're going to do is we do the chin, and the chin comes out. She is a witch after all, so it's going to come out and then go back and down. That's it. <laughs> and then we're going to come down with the back of her neck there. That's it. Oh. Okay. Then we do her plait. Now the plait <laughs> is going. Bald. It's going to go one, two. Three, four, four little um, kind of egg shapes. Some little lines in there if you can fit them. Okay. And then we can have a bow in the middle. So we're gonna go circle, shape, shape, and then a little bit of spike. Okay. Rock in. Oh. Now she's wearing a brooch. 
So I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna do it oval, and then again, pressing lightly, all the way around the edge for this nice little brooch. It's her favorite brooch. That's it. Cloak, watch carefully. Up a little bit, down, round, arm here so we have bits of a line and a line and a line that's it that's quite skinny <laughs> <laughs> and then you can't restart halfway through don't be so silly i'm going to go finger 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 that's going to be a challenge to get those fingers in <laughs> That's it. Oh. oh my goodness. <laughs> it's got like a withered hand. What's happened? I think a cat's eaten it. Then we're going to come down with the wand. We're going to go along like that. So she's holding it. And then up and up. And then we're going to do the star. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Are you doing a different drawing today? <laughs> Are you doing like something else? Does she think she's an archer? Okay. So then what we do is we're going to have a little line here. So we need the top of her skirt. So we're going to go line like that. And then we're going to come up and go down to about there. That's it. Now here, we're going to go like this. Now I think what we'll do is we'll do this arm here. So we're going to come down like that, and then down like that. And that arm's just going off behind the leg. That's it. It could be another skinny arm, don't worry. Go in there. And then we come down here, like that. And finally, <coughs> <laughs> you can't. Basically, you can't. Okay. So there we go. Let's just say she's been on a diet. <laughs> now we need her bottom. So the bottom's gonna come down from here, and it's gonna go around like that. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Now. She's actually got a cat sitting on her broomstick, but we're going to leave the cat out today. We're just going to draw her on her broomstick. So the um, we need to have this broomstick line here that goes through the skirt. I think first thing we'll do is we'll bring the skirt around and we'll do the base of the skirt. Like that. And one there. Okay, that's it. And then, this is the important bit, we want the broomstick coming through, so we're just going to come up, up and around. We have another spike behind the broomstick. Yeah, and that's it. Slightly bendy broomstick, never mind. We're then going to do the other part of the broomstick. So look, follow your line along so you know roughly the angle where it's going to come out. And it goes back to about here. So you can link those lines up. That's it. So her bottom is floating in the air. It's okay. <laughs> so funny. Back of the broomstick. <laughs> back of the broomstick. Come on, get on with it. Stick. A bit of uh, 
that stuff tied up. And then the very back of the mistake, which I'll we'll just look something like this. A sweet okay, try not to knock the camera. <laughs> it looks like a sweet <laughs> It looks like a Diablo. Right, oh. okay. Now, we need um, her legs, okay? So her legs are gonna come, sort of from this line here, okay? We're gonna come down. So we've got a leg kind of coming through there. And a funny little piece on it. <laughs> Look, you're distracting me, stop. <laughs> I don't want to look now. I can't look at your drawing. And there's a funny little boot. That's it. And then here, we've got one kind of kicking forward. So we're going to go line, line, like that. And the same kind of boot, like this. So it's kicking forward. What the hell is this? Oh my <laughs> Good. Yeah. So she's got I, stick, my drawing isn't really this bad. Cause... Stick legs. Oh, I think the viewers can judge themselves, Lucia. No, you're a brilliant artist. No, seriously. Okay. I, I don't draw like this. It's mm. like mm. under pressure. Under pressure? There's no pressure here, Lou. Right, so that is that. Now we need to have a cauldron. Now the cauldron needs to hang down here. So what we're gonna do is we need to have a handle and the handle's gonna come behind the sort of the, um, the wand like that and then down like this. Okay, so just get the handle so it clears all of the body. That's it, doesn't matter where it crosses. And then we're going to do a disc shape in the background that links those bits together, like that. With a little lip. Mm. And then the base. God, it looks like a pot of noodles. Mm, maybe it is. And then she's got these funny little feet on it, and the feet are like little, um, little arms or little legs, like that. Okay. Shall we try the cat? Or do you think we should leave it at that? Let's try the cat. Okay, so if you've got enough space, you can try the cat. Now the cat will just gonna start off with his eyes. Now he's small, so I'm gonna have to press very lightly with this new Sharpie. So I'm gonna go circle, circle. That was... <laughs> <laughs> That's a... <laughs> Oh, the cookie monster. <laughs> cookie. <laughs> and then his edge of his face. A little bit of a chin. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's got quite a wide nose. The cat. And he's got a smile. He's sitting on this, um, this broomstick, so his back's going to come down and then we're going to go up with the tail, like that. <laughs> and then we have a leg like this. Coming down like that, holding on. Bit of 
body there. And then this other core holding on there. Okay. The witch had a cat and a hat that was black. Mm -hmm. Her long ginger hair and a braid down her back. How the cat purred and how the witch grinned as they sat on their broomstick and flew through the wind. Look at that guy! <laughs> That's like, brilliant. That's the real version and this is like the mean version. I think so. Thank you, Lucy, and that was great. <laughs> so let's get this um, witch coloured in. Um, you'll probably want to speed this up. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for joining us today. And we would love to see some of your examples. So do send them into gallery at artroombryson.co.uk. And we'll see you very soon.